Incredibly, one man found himself inside a tornado funnel and lived to tell about it. He was Roy Hall. His widow vividly recalls that day in May 1948. It was a windy, windy day all day long. It kept getting darker and darker. My husband said, there has to be a tornado. He stayed out on the lawn with his camera and suddenly big hail the size of grapefruit started falling. He came on through the house. He was going to the back room where we were and it knocked him down. He was lying on his back. Suddenly the house was gone and he looked up right into the eye of the tornado. Paul's vision comes alive in his own words. Something had billowed down from above. It was the lower end of the funnel. I was looking at its inside. The funnel extended upward for over a thousand feet, swaying and bending. It seemed to be partly filled with a bright cloud which shimmered like a fluorescent light. Roy Hall's family counted themselves lucky to survive an encounter they never sought.